YouTube tuning in to In The Mix with your Funko Fix. This is Doggy, what's happening, everybody? How's everybody day going so far? Hope everything's good. Hope everybody blessed, you know what I'm saying? But um, let's get to this, though. You know what I'm saying? I got a package today. As you can see, box a little crushed up. A lot crushed up. Look like a dentation right here from somebody's uh, foot kicking it. Look like a boot print. Hold on, let me see something. Hold on. Yeah, this look like a boot print right here. No bullshit, man. Look at this shit, man. I had to go get one of my similar specials. Look at this shit. Look like a boot print right there, right? Yeah, that look like a boot print. But anyway, got this from Galactic Toys. Uh, most collectors probably already know by now. If you don't, um, Galactic Toys had an exclusive. Uh... Legendary Super Saiyan Broly, six inch pop. Um, you had a choice. I mean, you don't have a choice, but you you order the pop, and you're you're afforded a chance to uh receive the chase with it, glow in the dark chase. And this is the Broly right here, six inch Broly. As you can see. It looks a little better than it did before. It was really damaged. I had did the crease trick, you know, took it apart, folded it, pressed it, you know, just to try to help out with a lot of the crease and a lot of the damage that was on it because it came very damaged. And my thing is, being a collector, I know things do come in damage. So, you know, I try not to get too mad about it. And especially when you know the people that you're ordering from are actually good people, you know what I'm saying? Solid people, they understand the collector's uh, uh, requests to have their shit in pristine condition, coming in pristine condition. So I, I enjoy ordering from companies that offer to reimburse the, the consumer, you know what I'm saying? If something gets damaged or whatever. But when you're dealing with a company that automatically puts a disclaimer on shipping and handling shit like that like some shady there like they really don't give a fuck you know what i'm saying like at the end of the day when spike puts out a disclaimer about the condition or uh, uh the, the the item gets to the to the consumer they, it's out of their hands you know what i'm saying they no longer have anything to do with the item that's 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 messed up you know what i'm saying especially when it comes to collectibles toys figurines shit like that like come on man like are you serious you knock on reimburse people for damages and shit like that i cool but with this being exclusive and also a glow chase you know what i mean like like right now i'm gonna put i'm gonna put a little separate picture right here of ebay listings ebay listings these are going like close to 300 doing some change to like two 250 and up you know what i'm saying the chases is People bidding for these chases, so you know, you know, it leads me to, to, to wonder if Galactic Toys are actually selling the chases, you know, under another account. You know what I'm saying? Because nobody else got chases. Who the fuck got chases in the last three months? Them shits was selling three months ago. You know what I'm saying? Like chases and shit like that, like for that for that amount of, of, of money. You know what I'm saying? So it just leads me to believe. That these people are actually doing some underhand slimy shit. You know what I'm saying? And honestly, I went in on them this morning. I went to IG once. I, You know, I seen how the condition came and I read the disclaimers and all that. And I had to look these people up because actually I wasn't following these people. I wasn't, right? They, I think I ordered a, a mystery box from them or something. I ordered something from them uh, maybe a year back. Last year sometime. And I didn't like the way, you know... Or uh, customer service ran their shit or whatever, or I just stopped following them, and that was a year ago. So now when this came up, and I checked in on them on Instagram, and I left a comment, you know what I'm saying? I ain't leaving nothing not, not real crazy. I just let them know how I felt, you know what I'm saying, about the whole ordeal, and them not really checking in on the, on, 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 on the customers. Like, like, come on, man, you're not going to try and reimburse people or, you know, at least send the motherfuckers in some good packaging, you know what I'm saying? Like, look how they sent it. It's crazy. This is like a a big, this is a big ticket item right here. This is a big item right here. You know how many Dragon Ball Z fans there are? 
And actually, I don't even care about the globe. I would love to get the globe. Trust and believe, like, I will get the globe. I'll buy it. I'll, I'll second every bar. I'll get the globe. You know what I'm saying? Eventually. But what I'm saying is, I enjoy this pop. This pop is going in my Dragon Ball Z collection. You know what I'm saying? I enjoy it. And I'm, I'm going to keep this pop. Honestly, I think this is doper than the globe. You know what I'm saying? For me, looking at it. But, you know, I might have a change of heart when I get the glow in hand. You know that. But still in all, it's like, why are these people getting these exclusives, man? If they such, such dirtbag of a company, why Funko keep giving these people these, these these contracts, man? Like, dub these niggas, man. Like, for real, man. Like, how you gonna give these people exclusives and they treat it your, 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 top, your top customers like shit, like trash? Like, come on, man. And I know Galactic Toys is regular people like us, regular people, like, you know, nine to five people. They just doing the shit on the side or whatever the case may be. Like, come on, dog. Like, you know, it's a small world. We see people and I know y'all advertise y'all shit, Galactic Toys all over your shit. Like, like somebody want to run down, smack shit out of one of y'all. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. Like, this shit's crazy, B. But nonetheless, man, we going to see, I'm, I, you know... People I mess with, you know what I'm saying? They, they, everybody in tune. Everybody know what's going on. We just waiting to see how many chases pop up on Reddit. How many chases pop up on other little little sites, uh, or, you know, uh, uh, eBay, so forth and so on. We're going to see how many chases pop up. And we're going to do the math. You know what I'm saying? We're going to come to the collective and see if this is actually what's going on, man. Because if it is, y'all out of here, man. Like, we ain't, we ain't rocking with y'all, man. Y'all, y'all whack. Y'all whack for that, you know what I'm saying? But nonetheless, man, this was a vent, a rant, call it what you want. You know, I'm still everybody's favorite doggy, even though I'm not everybody's favorite doggy. Trust and believe that, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's real, man. Like, y'all, y'all playing games with collective shit, man. Shit got me hot, man. But, um, I'm a cool out, Musa, Musa, Musa. Back to the collective, though. This is dope, hot. Huh? We're going to take it out of the box. We're going to put it on the spinner. We're going to see how it spin. And um, I was kind of hoping to hit y'all with that glow glow. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I have to catch y'all on the next one. But this is a dope pop. This is super dope pop. And Funko, please stop giving these assholes these exclusives, man. Come on, man. Please, man. Stop giving these assholes exclusives like this, man. They shouldn't have that kind of power over the Funko community, man. And they treating us like shit, man. So please, man. Yeah, we're going to take this out of the box. We're going to look at the glow. And for everybody that watched this video, drop a like, comment, subscribe. Let's chop it up about these people, man. Come on, man. Let's stand up, man. Rise up on these motherfuckers. Rise up, man. Hold up, man. But, um, yeah, man. This shit damaged, man. This shit damaged like motherfuckers. This shit got me hot, man. Shit came in today. I was like... Oh, I was gonna put it on the side. I was gonna, I was gonna tuck the box on the side and let it build up, so I could do a big unboxing of a bunch of other shit and so forth and so on, like everybody else do. You know, let it build up. You know what I'm saying I ain't gonna put out, you know, three different videos every fucking day. Like, what do you do with your life, my man? You know what I'm saying? Like, get out that chair, go, go experience the world, go see what's going on, man. But you know, nonetheless, man, let's get to this uh, unboxing and look at it. It's a dope pop, man. I advise you guys to try to get this pop, man. It sucks you have to go through these people, man. But, you know, fingers crossed you get chased and you get a decent box, man. But I didn't. I didn't get neither. And I was kind of pissed off. But the thing that pissed me off is the, mo the, the most out of everything else is Galactic Toys blocking me. They blocked me on Instagram because I went in on them. You know what I'm saying? And it, it's just, it's ironic, man. Like, you motherfuckers, y'all do all this extra shit, but you can't take the, the comments. You can't take the, the backlash. Like, you got to, man. That's that's the part of being a successful motherfucking business or entity, man. You know, you got to take the, the good with the bad, man. Y'all can't take none of that. Y'all whack. That's how I know y'all into something under the, under, under the table. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all slimy, man. Always looking for a come up, man. However you get it, right? But, you know, 
everything come around full circle. That's why I don't do people dirty, man. I, I, I treat people how they how, how they want to, you know what I'm saying? Like, like how you supposed to treat people until they show you otherwise, you know what I'm saying? And I live by that, you know what I'm saying? But obviously people don't live by the morals, some principles, some codes, the ethic, you know what I'm saying? Like, like none of that shit exists with nothing no more. So, you know, it is what it is, man. That's why I try to link with some real funko community community people people that see the same thing i see you know we might not be on the same level personally on a personal level but we have similar interests and we could we could be cordial with each other and we could we could come to some kind of conclusion we could do things you know what i'm saying as a, as a whole as a unity you know what i'm saying unit oneness you know what i'm saying that's 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 what i'll be reaching for i'll be reaching out to different funko collectors so forth and so forth or uh, uh, so on uh, different YouTubers, I'll reach out, leave a comment, you know, shit like that, just trying to reach, I ain't trying to grab no, nobody's subscribers, I ain't doing, because if I don't get one person to watch this video, any of my videos, I'm okay, I'm good, I'm good, this shit don't move me, but what I'm saying is, as a collective, people need to rise up, man, get it together, man, fuck all that, you know, I'm bigger than you, I got more followers than you, and so forth and so on, I ain't gonna, you know, even comment on your shit, look at your shit, like, Honestly, me, when I first started this, I don't even have to look at a person's uh, video, the whole video. I don't have to look through the whole video. I'll just look at the video, and I like their video. I just like it for no reason. I just like it because they're doing something positive, and they're doing something I like to do. It could be it could be anything. It could be a, 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 a fucking trucker that talk like he got a mouth full of... To chewing tobacco in his mouth. If he talk about some Funkos, I like it. I might not watch the whole video, but I like the video just out of support. You know, people don't do that. You know, it's just a different time never, man. But anyway, let's get back to this. I've been rambling a long time. And I know y'all probably pissed off when I see this thing out of the box and I'm gonna spin a <laughs>